16 million Americans suffer from red, bumpy skin. It's a condition called rosacea. Well, now it looks like there's finally some relief. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez has the story. Good to see you. You too. Elena Litwin's first attack of rosacea could not have happened at a worse time. All right. I was actually giving a presentation in my college class, and my friend looked at me and was like, you are so red. The 23-year-old had just moved to New York. The change in temperatures triggered a flare-up of the common skin condition. You feel kind of heat rush to your face and then just little bumps appear that you just can't get rid of with any acne treatment that you try. Rosacea usually starts in adulthood as redness on the face that can progress to pimples, bumps, and visible blood vessels. The cause is not known, but prime suspects are bacteria and tiny mites called demodex that actually live in our pores. Litwin's dermatologist recommended a new FDA-approved prescription cream called Sulantra that is anti-inflammatory and has anti-mite activity. It's a whole new category of topical rosacea treatments. What we notice is that the redness is often reduced and the bumps of rosacea that are really annoying to patients and sometimes uncomfortable get better very quickly. Litwin says she saw improvements right away. This is her skin before and after using Sulantra. The bumps within two weeks were way better than they have ever been in my life. Dr. Doris Day is a consultant for the drug company. She says patients with rosacea need to be aware of what causes their flare-ups. The triggers are typically stress, alcohol, extremes in temperature, and some spices. Some patients report side effects from the cream, including skin irritation and a burning sensation. Rosacea can look like adult acne, so it's important to get the right diagnosis from a dermatologist. And while rosacea is most often seen in women, it's men who usually have the most severe symptoms. Left untreated, severe cases can lead to swollen, bumpy tissue, a so-called cauliflower nose. Dr. Max Gomez, CBS 2 News. And the medication is only available by prescription. Two of the big